Hello, and welcome back to Story Time with Little Sasha. If you like my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and share. My goal is to have 1,000 subscribers. So if you want, please share um, my channel with all of your friends. Today's story is What Should Danny Do? by Gant and I Dear Lovey. Illustrated by Matt Sadler. Dear reader, this is one of my favorite stories because there are nine different stories in this book. When you reach an ending, you can start over and make different choices to see how Danny's day changes. Today, I would like to explore if Danny made good positive choices. Hi, my name is Danny. My favorite things in the whole world are soccer, superheroes, and ninjas. I also love skateboards, but I don't have one yet. You may be wondering why I'm wearing a cape, so I'll let you in on my secret. I'm a superhero in training. That means I have some superpowers but I'm still working on the rest. For example, I jump super high. I run super fast. I have super muscles. And even though I can't fly just yet, I'm still working on it. Daddy says that my most important superpower of all is my power to choose. With this power, I can change my day by changing my choices. He even gives me the coolest new cape so that I won't forget. Today is a special day because you'll be making choices for me. When you get to the end of the day, you can start over and make different choices. Then we'll see if the power to choose really does change my day. Ready? Let's go! Mmm, do I smell pancakes? I love pancakes. I zoom downstairs. Chocolate chip pancakes! I yell. But then I see my brother Charlie eating from our Nijitsu Ninja plate. That plate is my favorite. I want the Ninja plate, I say. I know you love that plate, Mommy says. But Charlie is already eating from it. She puts two pancakes in front of me, but they're on an alphabet plate. I already know my alphabet. What should Danny do? Eat the pancakes on the alphabet plate? Go to page 26. Yell until he gets the ninja plate. Today, I want to explore Danny's good choices. So we're gonna go to page 26. But can I get the ninja plate next time, I ask. Mommy smiles and says, of course. The pancakes are delicious. I can feel them charging my superpowers with every bite. After we finish, Mommy tells us to get ready because we're going to the park. Score! I love the park. Do you want to set up a lemonade stand while we're there, Mommy asks. Yes, I say. No way, Charlie pouts. I want to play at the park, not work. You can play, Mommy says, but you won't get to share the money if you don't help Danny. That's okay with me, Charlie says. I quickly get dressed, then make a big lemonade sign. I get 10 lemons, two pitchers, and some sugar. I'm lucky I have the super muscles to carry it all. I squeeze the lemons, but the last one is really hard. I summon my super strength and finally get the juice to come out. But then, oops, the juice squirts right into my eye. Ow! It stings so much I start to cry. Charlie laughs at me. What should Danny do? Stop really hard on Charlie's foot? Go to page 56. Tell Charlie that isn't nice. 
go to page 34. We're going to see what the power to make a good choice can do. Laughing at me isn't nice, I tell Charlie. Mommy is happy I used my words to let Charlie know how I feel. She helps me rinse my eye and the sting slowly goes away. I finish making the lemonade and Mommy lets me have a whole glass. Mmm, that makes my eye feel even better. We get to the park and Charlie runs off to play. At first, no one wants my lemonade. But then, a great idea pops into my head. I use my laser beam focus to turn the plain lemonade into super lemonade. I shout as loud as I can. Fresh squeezed super lemonade, only 50 cents. Drink some and get a superpower for the day. My idea works. After an hour, I just have one cup left. I see a girl running towards me. I use my mind reading ability to see that she wants a superpower of her own. But then, oops, she strips and knocks my table down. The last cup of lemonade spills all over my shirt. What should Danny do? Help the girl up. Go to page 13.8 yell at the girl for spilling his last cup. Go to page 42. Hmm, let's see what a good choice does for Danny. I help the girl up. I'm so sorry, she says. Don't worry, I tell her. It's just an accident. Her mom pays me a whole dollar for the cup she spilled even though my mommy says she doesn't have to. Score! I made $26 from the lemonade stand. I remember to set $3 aside for charity, so I have $23 left. Mommy surprises me and takes me to the toy store because of how good I've been today. I know exactly what I want to get, and I've made just enough money to buy it. I get home and ride my skateboard down the street. Wow, I'm finally flying! Whoosh! My best friend Jakey sees me and says, Whoa, Danny, how did you get that cool skateboard? I tell him about my superpower lemonade and offer to help him make some next week. He's super excited. I'm proud of how you've used your power to choose today, Danny, Mommy says. So I'll let you make one more choice. What we'll have for dinner? Hmm, I wonder what food will charge my superpowers best. The end. I hope you liked today's story, and I hope you go today making good choices. Thanks for reading with me. And if you like my channel, please subscribe and share and tell all your friends. I'll read with you next time. Bye.